what is up guys welcome back another episode here of bass and furious tv thank you guys for tuning in i'm um, kind of doing a little short video today just want to talk to you guys about a rod that i've been doing really well with here as of late it's a rod by 13 fishing of course right um but guys they got some stuff for everybody all price ranges uh high low whatever the case may be whatever you need man they got they got some good stuff um i even saw a recent video from tactical bass and where they even actually recommended a couple um 13 fishing gear as well as it's some stuff they've tried out and you know does pretty well especially for the the price you pay and sometimes you get i feel like a little bit more than what you pay for in my opinion and not just because i'm on the squad you know i've, I've used this stuff guys i use it all the time because I, I don't you guys know about my channel i don't i don't feed you guys any any lies right um trying to give you guys stuff only stuff i actually deal with but today i want to talk to you guys about a rod that i've been using a lot here especially during the winter and i'm going to tell you a couple of reasons why i think it's great so here let's get it right in your little guy a little lady that you want to catch um start catching some fish this is what it's kind of it's kind of what it's geared towards and what it's for i found it very useful guys to use as a bank angler now four foot six medium light fast action i ain't gonna be throwing those square bills i mean not no uh spinner baits and you know big jigs and stuff like that but a lot of times when you're fishing from the bank it's might you know depending on where you're at it's a lot more pressure um sometimes a lot of times you do find yourself downsizing a lot so if i'm a downsize and throw a ned rig a drop shot um a little a light jerk bait i throw a regular size jerk bait i throw a 110 on it that's what i've been throwing i don't i've been throwing a 110 jerk bait eight pound test on this and have been lighting them up at every pond i go to so i i think this really comes into play for your bank anglers because as you guys look right behind me right what do you see there trees how many times do you bring your seven foot six or seven foot two medium heavy action rod you get out here and this guy's look how many times do you do you go to make a cast and your pole gets end up stuck in the tree this four foot six pole you can throw it in anywhere you can throw it in your little camry throw it in your prius grab you a couple baits a little bag this is this i'll show you guys what i do normally this is what i normally do so i'll bring a little bag i got a 13 fishing crank bait a jerk bait and a couple of soft plastic swim baits and some swim uh, jig heads in one little like zoom bag or whatever bag i use for your plastics put it in the bag throw it in your pocket grab your favorite hoodie or jacket grab a little four foot six ambition and you can head out and fish anywhere so i think that's where this really shines at for me personally because i'm always throwing a spinning pole anyway spinning rod spinning reel um having it be a little bit smaller i can cast a little bit better it's been actually working really good for my back because i like to walk a lot when i fish so it's really light you put the right pound test line on it and you can basically you can go to work so that i don't mean for it to be like an infomercial you know me just telling you about what i'm doing i actually think this can help some people when they look into it either get it for your kids great sure if your kid's name also is the same name as yours and you get it for yourself then do that but it's really good it's four foot six it's Trust me, you, you want to give it a try. 